we're gonna talk about equipment not none of this equipment I'm going to talk about the equipment that I'm using to make these videos I'm gonna talk to you about what I use not necessarily what's the best I'm using my iPhone I'm using the front camera simple you don't need some two thousand five thousand dollar camera to do a YouTube vlogging video just because you see all these big guys big shots like Casey Neistat and these other dudes yeah they got the big cameras that's their livelihood I think not sure but who cares I'm using an iPhone and that's all that matters as long as I could get a picture on there upload it to YouTube that's all I care uh, daughter has a Barbie camera use that if you have to and right now I'm using the front camera on my iPhone quick tip though if you're gonna use a camera on your phone better to use the camera on the back of the phone you get a better quality picture obviously I'm using the front just so you could kind of see the quality this is the back of the camera on my iPhone this is the quality you're gonna get okay I mean you may not know the difference but to the trained eye you can tell the difference it might not matter to you it doesn't really matter to me here's another quick tip they're free I'm giving it to y'all guys tip one use a back camera tip number two check it out you could have the most expensive expensive Casey Knight stat camera best camera on the market right now but if your audio sucks your whole production sucks it's better to have a good microphone shotgun mic or one like a lavalier mic you could put on and have a crappy camera and you will have a better production video than one with crappy sound hopefully I'm not confusing you guys that's tip number two it's all free why not it's almost Christmas time better to give than to receive it's a GoPro as you can see I have a shotgun mic you could uh, have crappy video and awesome audio and your production will be good all right fellas wanted to make a really quick point about having a shotgun mic before I had the uh, shotgun mic to the GoPro I noticed that I was getting a lot of uh, just annoying sounds and uh, it was just, it, it kind of sounded like a static sound every time I would turn and flip the GoPro and it sounded something like this you hear that spend a little bit of money on a uh, external mic guys for whatever camera you're using if you're using your, your iPhone you could actually buy actually wait let me show you now if you're using a phone device strongly advise that you get one of these this one's the video mic me it's a little shotgun mic it hooks up it hooks up to your phone and once you put it on your phone well there you go you could hold your phone vlog and you got your little microphone and voila windy conditions it comes with this right here they call this a dead cat it goes BAM like that it's almost as big as my face but anyways guys audio is important <laughs> Also, I have a lavalier mic that I use sometimes. Not so much on my vlogs because I don't got time to put it on. I have a wireless lavalier mic, which can go on here. I'm using the GoPro 5 Black. Okay, this gold case is just a case. Watch, I'll even take it apart for you. This is all it is, check it out. Gold, I don't know why I got it. I think I paid $31. All it is is a protective covering, that's all it is. You got the little screen in the back. It's all a touch screen, it's pretty cool. Okay, okay, well that's it. Look how small it is. And I'm not gonna say any names. It drives a person like me nuts. I don't know. Okay, well that's it. Like I said, this is just the housing. Heavy duty, bam. I paid like 30 bucks. Now let's go check out my software, what I use to edit these YouTube videos that you guys see. Let's go. What I'm using here is a MacBook Pro. This had, this computer has lasted me about eight years. I've dropped it, spilled sweet tea on it. When you get a Mac, you get iMovie. iMovie is easy to use. It's simple. It's awesome. It gets the job done. You got your uh, screen up here. You got your timeline right here. It's kind of hard. I'm sorry if you can't see me. See uh, my finger, but my finger's over here. You know, you got your timeline. You can make your cut, 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 cut. So you could put transitions in between. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. And other transition. 
spline on the wheel here, the mark mower box. And then of course down here, you have your audio, your music. <laughs> simple you know you have your media here's all your on this side is where you have all of your your clips your video that you uploaded to your computer and you kind of pick and then you drag it down to your timeline it's pretty simple you know there it is guys like I said iMovie perfect it's simple it's easy you don't need to be a rocket scientist in order to figure this out drag your clips into the timeline chop them up the way you want it put some music upload it to youtube man i think somebody was asked if you get a mac if it's compatible with an android phone the answer is yes it is apologize that you know this wasn't really much about lawn care actually come on i don't apologize let's go ahead and uh because this is this is a lawn care channel right tell you what we'll do because this is a lawn care channel we're about to do a leaf cleanup, okay? We're gonna pick up, we'll pick up a couple of leaves. How about that? Ugh. There, got leaves. Let's go throw them. Let's go, let's go put them where they belong. In the trash, right here. Cool. No, no, okay, we need to do more lawn care. Fine. We got some lava rocks that are misplaced. Let's go ahead and uh, let's see. That one's out of place. I think it belongs right there. Cool. Stay tuned, Blade Runners. Yeah.